welcome back to my channel today we are here to plan for the first week of september 2024 so i have here my catch-all planner that i use mostly for work and like i have done in the previous weeks i pre-planned everything for this week on my weekly view let me just get into it there it is so this is this week in our weekly view and differently from the previous weeks I decided to do a, things a little bit differently so this was the previous week and as you can see this week is much more full and I try to kind of separate things into time blocks because this week I'll be traveling so I'll be traveling for work and I'll be traveling on Monday and I'm going to come back on Friday at night and I tried to to plan what I'm going to do during the trip but I can't control everything so we're going to have a look at what we can do first of all for our weekly planning I need to go ahead and write down the tasks that I have for this week so let's go back into the previous week and check what we didn't finish and what we have to do. So this is going to be finally September and this is going to be the first week of September. And let's go ahead and write things that I can do during my work trip because most of the day I will be at the lab and I'll be doing some follow-up activities with the guys there. So I won't have a lot of time to be on meetings and also to do the tasks that I usually do. So let me just go ahead and choose what is most relevant from all of these. So first of all is the dissection instructions. This I'm going to do with the guys there. So we have to do. Maybe we'll talk about also the NSI anchoring, but I'm not sure. I'm just going to put here in case we do talk about it during my stay there. And one thing I'm going to work on as well is going to be the um, test procedure template. I need to discuss a couple of points with the lab technician there. Test procedure template, there you go. And then let's see, organize, visit. I won't be able to do that. Align technical note. Um, not going to do that probably, but I'm going to put here technical note in case we are able to advance in that. This is going to be T1 for 068. The dissection report, all of the documents that are in yellow, I know it, they won't get done for the next two weeks. So I'm just going to leave it as is. I think that's pretty much all that I can do in terms of tasks this week. Maybe I can do some FTB day planning. This must be done as soon as possible actually, so I have to organize that. Then I have to update the weeklies for T1 and T3 like we always do every single week. And just because I'm traveling doesn't mean that I won't be able to do that. I can do that even though I'm traveling. Um, update OBEA won't be done. Training matrix, I won't have time. I will need to complete my ETS. But then that's all that I have for this week. Now let's go back. Let me check my monthly tasks as well. So I have here, let me just grab that actually. And we are going to compare with what we have for the for August. So we have here our light template, anchoring, dissection report is here as well, flowchart, training matrix, Python course, mounting test report anchoring instructions yeah that's good and let's see what else i won't be able to finish here i'm going to write technical note d1068 um da, da, da. let's see this is here okay that's good now let's go back and i'm going to write everything that wasn't done on the previous week so sign rb2 rli 
Rev 1. I think this one we actually did. Let me check last week. Oh, I think last week is not here. But I think we did that. Pretty sure we did that. Not sure. I have to check that. But if we didn't, then that's, that's something that I'm going to have to do. Now here I need to do test procedure template. And I think that's all of it. All that I need to do. For September, there's something else as well. Partial report. Oh no, it's already here. Okay, so that's good. It's already planned. Let's go back and put this right here on the monthly. And I think that's all in terms of tasks for this week. So let's go back and grab the Witi. Oh, I forget that it's here. <laughs> here it is, the weekly. Let's go into the dailies. So we have here Monday and Tuesday. Let's start with Monday. So Monday, I have my flight at seven work trip flight okay where are my dot stickers there they are just going to put here so my plan is to wake up at five so wake up and then i'm going to commute at 5.30 and I'm going to wait at the airport at 6. I like to arrive early this way I know I won't have any issues. Okay, so that's the idea. Now in terms of planning, I already put here that after my trip, the idea is to pick up the car. So I'm just going to write here, whoops. My me mechanical pencil didn't want to work, but that's fine. So pick up car at the airport. Then we are going to commute to the lab and that's going to take about one hour, I think. Then we are going to do stuff here between this time and 11. I'm just going to actually, I put here that I'm going to arrive at the lab at approximately 10. So I'm just going to do that because this way I have a margin if anything goes wrong. Um, okay, then we will have some activities here. We'll have lunch and then we'll have more activities until I think maximum 5.30. So that's what I'm planning, 5.30. And then we're going to commute back to the hotel. And that's probably going to take one hour. I'm going to go to the gym here then I'm going to have a shower and finally we're going to have dinner for about one hour and then we'll be back. I think that's the planning that I have. Actually, if I, yeah, I think that's all. Okay, so for Monday, let's see if I'm able to do a couple different things. First off, all I need to update the T1 weekly and also the three, um, T3 weekly. I'm going to put here gym as well. Let's see if I'm able to do that. Um, let's see what else I can try to do that day. I can try to discuss the dissection instructions for 75049. And I think that's all that I'm going to do for Monday. I'll be quite tired because I will have woken up at five. So yeah, that's going to be it for Monday. Let's go into Tuesday. Tuesday, I'm not sure at what time I'm going to start, but I think I'm going to commute at around seven, most likely, and I'm going to get there at eight. That's what I'm guessing, okay? 
So probably you wake up at 6 and breakfast at 6.30. That's what I'm imagining. So on t Tuesday, I have a meeting. This is going to be the T1 update for 53068. And I also have the sprint planning for this project. Uh, I also have the Obeya at 2. So 75049 Obeya. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to have any of these meetings, okay? Because I'll be following a couple of activities at the lab, but I'll try to do them as well. Okay, so we have these meetings here. Most of them are just half an hour, which helps, but I don't think I'll be able to participate either way. Okay, there you go. So my idea is to arrive at eight and then have lunch at 12 o'clock and get back at 5.30. And we're going to repeat, we're going to commute right after, arrive there and I'll go do some exercise. Then I'm going to shower. Then we are going to have dinner. And then I can do whatever I want. Okay, I think that's all for Tuesday. Now, in terms of tasks, let's see what I can add here. Um, I'll try to think a little bit more about the dissection instructions for 049. And let's see what else. Oh, yeah, I need to talk about the test procedure template. So that's something I can do on Tuesday or whenever I have time. And I think that's pretty much it for Tuesday. On to Wednesday. So Wednesday I have an exciting event, which is going to be the lunch with leaders. So I'm just going to write down, it starts at 12 o'clock. So lunch with leadership. So that's going to be one hour and a half, most likely. So let's go ahead and grab a bigger sticker here. There you go. And let's see what else do we have. We have a lot knowledge sharing that again, I'm not sure if I'll be able to participate on that firstly, because I'll be at the lab. Secondly, because maybe the lunch won't be over so soon, but we'll see. So this is going to be half an hour as well. There we go. And the same idea, I think I'm going to wake up at six, then I'm going to have breakfast at 6.30, then we're going to commute for about one hour, and I'm going to start work at eight, stop at 12, then we're going to have this lunch here, and I'm going to finish work at 5.30 most likely, and then we're going to commute, always the same thing, commute, I'm going to do some exercise, shower, and finally dinner. And I'm using my mechanical pencil because again, since this is a work trip, things can change. So I just need to make sure that I have the possibility to change things. So I wanted to go to the gym or exercise at least four times a week. So I'm going to go on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And then Friday, I won't be able to go because I'll be at the airport. So that's why I'm putting three, four consecutive days. So on Thursday, I don't have anything organized. So I'm just going to go ahead and write down the times that I think I'm going to start work, have lunch, and then go back to the hotel and exercise and all of that. So again, wake up at five, then I'm going to have breakfast and we're going to commute, then work, lunch, commute back to the hotel, then exercise, shower and dinner. Okay. Gym here. And finally, on to Friday. Friday, we have a couple of things. 
first I have a knowledge sharing at 10. So knowledge sharing. Again, not sure if I'll be able to participate on that, but I'm going to write it anyway. So this is the only meeting that I have on Friday. And then at 8.20, I have my flight back home. And that's probably going to take one hour. There we go. We'll have plenty of time because usually we are going to finish at 5.30. We are going to commute. This is probably going to take one hour. Uh, give the car back. Actually, I don't think we're going to give the car back because one of our colleagues is not going back home. He's staying there, so he's going to stay with the car. Uh, that's fine. So flight back home and then commute and I'll probably be home by 10.30. There you go. So it's going to be pretty tiring all this time traveling. I'm going to have quite a few extra hours, but that's good. Okay, I think we are done with the planning. Oh yeah, the only thing that I need to put here on Friday is that I need to complete my ETS. Okay, that's great. So that was the planning for this week. Nothing too exciting because like I said, I'll be traveling most of the week and I, I will only do one activity while I'm traveling, which will be following the activities that are being performed at the lab. Let's just put everything back into my planner and we'll be done for today. There you go. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave your like and also subscribe here to my channel. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye.